you guys hey you guys it's your girl kayla b you know me and i'm coming at you with another video just another video this is a first impression i already did majority of my face i did my eyes i did my brows i did a foundation full tint and moisturizer to be exact to be exact this is the morphe spf 30 broad spectrum foundation the glow stunner foundation this is really really good really really good really good that's what i can say it's like it's really really good <laughs> really good um yeah so i used this and it's i think it's supposed to be going on july 3rd it's supposed to be out so yeah i used that it's really really good like i say it's it's really really good it's a buildable it gives you a glow it doesn't matter what what, what foundation i have i have the um the shade deep glow 14 this really is really good this right here let me just put it like right there this is really good even though it looks a little red it looks it just melts into your skin and i like it i like it i like it a lot um and also i have spf 30 so you know your girl is going to be protected anyways let's get into this let's you know let's get into it um i'm gonna use the first product well we only have two products the first product i'm going to be talking about is the don't settle concealer from kaja if i could open it this is what the packaging is looking like don't mind my nails i'm gonna do my nails soon almost dropped it this is what it looks like right here i have the shade coffee bean yeah 17. hopefully it's not too dark i ordered this online but it looks it looks like foundation shade not concealer shade so i'm just gonna put it around town you know what i do on my nose right here right here dip right back in same here right here nose cover up that mustache area finalize my brows type thing and let's just go into town now this right here is cruelty free kaja is a k beauty brand um, this retails for $16. It also has a medium coverage. It's buildable. It's like this, this like sheer medium coverage. It's buildable. It's good for normal, dry, oily, and combination skin. This right here is not bathing and safe. It's good for sensitive skin or if it's good for mature skin. So that's what they left out of everything. That's why they didn't say it's for all skin types. Um, this is medium, buildable, flexible, this is hydrating, and this concealer, what is that? I can't even read my own handwriting. They say it's medium, buildable, flexible. Yeah, that's basically what it is, medium, flexible. Oh, seamless natural finish. That is what I put down. Yeah, this has a natural finish. It's supposed to have a natural finish. So let's just get up into it. Where's my name? Where's the palette? It's the palette that I used today. <laughs> I bought my I buttoned my shirt like a little bit because I'm gonna tie it up later. So yeah. So I do see some colors after letting it sit down for a bit but like not enough where it's like full coverage that it doesn't pair well with this tinted moisturizer it pairs really well with this tinted moisturizer but usually like k-beauty brands usually do so yeah i'm gonna go in with one more dunk if you would say so one more just for like i really do like this but this top is gonna get dirty it already got dirty a little bit it's gonna get dirty like real quick it got dirty yeah but it, i try to make it not get dirty but you know my hands wow it 
definitely look like it's like no type of difference. Like it's like no difference. I'm just gonna do everything on the wand and everything. Yeah, I'm gonna have to see it got dirty. I'm gonna have to clean that when I'm done with everything. I've really been liking my elf sponge. I really have been liking my elf sponge. Like I forgot how much like how great sponges are. Cause I was like, no, I need brushes. I need if I get a brush real quick, I can do my makeup with brushes, but like it just like takes it takes everything out and like I don't need anything. They, it says it's not supposed to be creasing because of the flexible formula. So we're gonna see that. We're gonna see if it is or not. But yeah, it's hydrating. It goes great with the glow, glow nation, glow stunner, um, tinted moisturizer from Morphe. So yeah. I like the way it looks. I'm a powder, and then we're gonna go on to the last product, or well, the next product. Okay, the next and last thing that we're gonna be talking about today is none other than House of Lashes lashes. I don't know if I tried this before. This is in the shade Iconic. I know, I think I've tried House of Lashes lashes, but I kind of don't remember, so. Yeah, yeah. I really hope I don't have to cut these because the last lashes that I had to do, I had to cut these. I had to cut them, and I don't like cutting lashes. I like them just to be like able to plop right on. You know, lashes. See if I can. Well, okay, this is something different to be honest. Well, you can see the difference. You could definitely see the difference. Well, okay, I'm not mad at it. It's a little hard, the blood is not flexible. It's a little hard to put on in the beginning, but it's on there now. It's on there now. So my first impressions about these lashes that they're they're definitely dramatic. They're not for a person that just put on tinted moisturizer. They're more for a full beat type of thing. But you know, it is what it is. I want to see if they blend well with my lashes. I'm gonna use the Brad mascara again. This mascara is okay. If you're gonna see the review, the review is gonna be like next week. And the review is definitely gonna be next week. Cause I have a mask on Monday for you guys. And then this Sunday is the first Sunday of July. So I gotta go do my shot my stash video. Oh, I just, I poked myself in the eye. Oh no. But I'm okay. It was like a little light poke. I did a little bit of crying, but you know. Power through, we gotta power through. So this is what this eye looks like with the lashes. And this is what the lashes look like without it. It looks like non-existent. So it's okay. I mean, 
technically they're only, only going to see this part because I have to still wear a mask around um, the bus and everything else. And you guys know I love public transportation. So if you have a unlimited metro card in New York City, that you can go anywhere. You don't have to pay. Like you can go anywhere every single day. That you could take as many trips as you want. You can go on um, those buses to go to across the um, thing, but you just have to go to the ferry. Like <laughs> you had to take the ferry. You don't want to take the ferry, but you got to take the ferry. You can't go on some buses because they want they don't. They don't charge 275. They charge more than 275. Plus, the kid on you for just like dry, dry. So I know where to put on my lashes. Like, so I have like an idea where to put them on. Okay. They're on. The second one is on and closed. So secured. Everything is Gucci. And they look even. Oh, I love lashes that look even. Because one eye is bigger than the other eye. So sometimes lashes does not look even on me. But these lashes look even. I love that. I love that. So, to be honest, I think I like House of Lashes. Lashes. I know I like Kiss Lashes. I know I like Baddington Lashes. Now I know I just like House of Lashes Lashes. Now I know if I like Lily Lashes. Because their mascara was okay. It wasn't, it wasn't too like, oh my gosh. You know? Wow. Well, these are really beautiful. Like, I thought I couldn't pull these off, but I could pull them off. Like, whoa. Mm. Who is that girl? That's Kayla Vance from Mary Beauty. Ah, uh, okay. So, this is what my face is looking like. Overall, those two products, I really like the lashes and I like the concealer. I'm going to have to see how it holds up, but it goes well with a gold tinted moisturizer. Again, it's sheer medium. It's buildable coverage. And let's see if it's, I'm going to have to see if it's flexible. But overall, I like the House of Lashes and I like, I like the concealer. I like both of them. This is like the first First Impression Friday that I like everything. If you like this type of setup, I'm going to keep on doing this type of setup. I'm not going to do the other setup like I did. I keep on doing because this this is better. I can, like, the window is right here and there's a window behind me. So it's like the light is coming through. What do you think? Hmm? Let me know down below in the description box also. These products will be in the description box plus prices. And also my social medias aka tiktok and instagram so go check it out and it will be a video right here video right here head right here and have a great rest of your day bye you guys